This is Namrata Gulati Safra, Deputy Editor at SAR Energy International. With us is Mr. Avinash Hira Nandani, Global CEO and Managing Director at Renewsys. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you, Namrata. Always a pleasure to meet SAR Energy. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so firstly, please tell us about your new launches at the expo. So we have recent. Uh, in fact, we have launched our Topcon range yesterday. We have in Topcon we have introduced glass and transparent backsheet, as well as glass to glass solar panels. In our encapsulant and backsheet business, in backsheet we have a transparent backsheet that we make, and also PoE and EPE specially designed for end type Topcon solar panels. At the expo this time, uh, end type uh, you know Topcon is taking precedence over everything else. So how do you view this technology? Do you think this is a technology of the future? And what is your take on glass to glass modules? So glass to glass panels have been there for a long time and glass to glass panels are also required for the utility scale in India but glass with back sheet as well as glass with transparent back sheet are also here to say because of the weight of the panels and also having a similar kind of performance as glass to glass. Uh, tell us about your international projects and your export markets. So we have been exporting our encapsulants and back sheet all over the world to US, Germany, Middle East, Africa, many countries we have been supplying and we will be continuing to supply these products. As far as solar panels are concerned, we also supply solar panels to the international market and it's a good business for India to be exporting today. Do you, are you, do you also export to the US? We haven't started exporting to the US because of the traceability of the product. But as soon as we find a traceable product which we are 100% sure about, we will definitely start selling to US as well. Okay. And tell us about your future ambitions. Uh, what are the capacities that you're looking at, say, in the next two to three years? So currently we have about one gigawatt facility at our Patalganga plant. And we continue to add capacity. We'll be doubling by next six months. We'll double our capacity. And we'll further double our capacity to four gigawatts by next one and a half years. So the capacity continues to grow in uh, our module business. In encapsulant business and in POE, we will again double our capacity here to 11 to 12 gigawatts. Right. And uh, tell us about your floating solar projects. So in floating solar, we are specially offering a special type of back sheet, which has a very, very low moisture vapor transmission ratio. Basically, it means that no water can get inside, even though the panel is very close to the water. So, uh, it is a special PVDF based back sheet and uh, it's a very popular product for us for floating solar. So, I would recommend everybody to speak to us if they are looking for a glass and back sheet solar panel for floating solar application. And how is the Indian market responding to this new launch? So, Indian market is all excited. It's also thank to the, thanks to the government for creating such a huge demand side. So, when the demand is there, if you can pan your camera and see or show your viewers. This whole exhibition is full. There's hardly any time to do this interview as well. So there's a lot of excitement in India for solar panels. Thank you so much for the interaction. Thank you so much. Thanks, Thank Energy. Thank you. Thank you.